be more curious about it and to learn more about it. And really love having my period. This wasn't something that I realized um, ever since the beginning. I was shocked about the amount of blood that I was producing. <laughs> then, after years and years, you just get used of this. So I just know, I just know, I just But even if I feel pain during this day, I just welcome the pain. And oh, yeah. Welcome the pain if we have it and of course try trying not to, to have it anymore finding out about homemade remedies for pain such as maca for example i don't know what's the name of it in english but it's a kind of root that really helps for menstrual pain los orgasmos son capaces de reducir muchísimo los dolores a mí hay una postura que me calma mucho que es estar de de cuclillas el médico es mandarte medicinas para todo Pero no tratan la raíz del problema, ¿sabes? Okay. Also welcome the different situations. Also welcome the need, the need of rest, of resting and, and relaxing. This is the favorite part about my period: withdrawing, going into the darkness, going into comfort, and just being me. Being me. If period, I like to slow down a bit if I can. Because I'm also I'm I'm always like dancing and doing handstands and stuff. And when I get my period, I don't like to go upwards. Uh, usually I do um, less harsh sports. I just do like a yoga session, a stretching session, something gentle that is still serving. Being in the nature, even though I have always this tight feeling in my belly. Uh, it does. It does help, and the motivation of doing something you really like and you're really excited about, I find, really helps to have a good mom. Have a good mom. To share, it's the uh, seed cycling for the period. So um, when you are, it divides the cycle in, into into moments from menstruation to ovulation, yeah. Um, you can add to your normal meals pumpkin, flax and, and chia seeds. And when you are from ovulation to menstruation, yeah, in those 14 days, you change and you add sesame and sunflower seeds to your normal food. Hmm? Por favor, rieten sus plantas con la sangre menstrual. Like giving my my blood to the um, to the nature, if I'm able to. For my period, I can feed my plants. Coge la sangre de la copa menstrual, se vierte en un recipiente, se pone más o menos un litro de agua, se remueve y se echa a las macetas, ¿vale? To look to our blood, no? Look, look at it, connect. To it and, and do whatever you feel with it. <laughs> That's amazing. Eh, desde que uso la copa, como que mis reglas son mucho más, más naturales. ¿no? Yo la verdad es que me he reconciliado muchísimo con la regla desde que uso la copa menstrual. Ah, me ha salvado la vida, o sea, aparte de, de que pues nos ayuda bastante al medio ambiente, eh, me parece lo más higiénico y lo más cómodo del mundo. Productos de, de higiene femenina, como los llaman, eh, nos alteran muchísimo lo que es nuestra flora y nuestra, nuestra menstruación en sí. Se habla muy poco de cómo sangramos, qué sangramos, ¿no? Parece que es sangre líquida y, y, y roja y preciosa y es como, bueno, pues... Eh, Muchas veces no es así, ¿no? Y lleva coágulos y demás. Entonces a mí es algo que también me ha gustado mucho, el hecho de, la, de utilizar la copa para conocer qué sangro. Eh, ser consciente de qué le pasa a tu cuerpo, de ver lo que sangras, tocar lo que echas todos los meses. Dejar todo el mundo de compresas y tampones ha sido de las mejores decisiones que he podido tomar. Sí, es verdad que me costó un poco igual introducirme, ¿no?
And then I was like, I'm not gonna be able to get this out. <laughs> that was the most scary part. Like getting it out. I felt I was I had to go to the hospital or something. O luego con la, con la sangre, imagínate que estoy eh, en un garito y es como, pues mira, la, la tiras al váter, eh, sacas la copa del baño, la, le das un agua y te la vuelves a meter. Y si alguien se escandaliza por ver un poco de sangre, es su problema, ¿no? And I remember the first time I saw my blood in the cup, I felt so powerful, so powerful. I discovered that it's something with a lot of In ancient wisdom, tied in with the cycles of nature, it's raw and wonderful. Feel this to, to understand how our, our body works. Y, y así era mi ciclo menstrual hasta que decidí cortarlo y decidí tomar las hormonas anticonceptivas. It gives you information. And every month we clean ourselves through the bleeding. One of the best things about menstruation is that it cleanses our inferior body, right? Right. Yeah, 100%. 100%. I love that my period is similar to a lunar phase, tied in with the deep wisdom of nature. I always feel drawn out into the darkness during a full moon. I appreciate the changes of my tiny breast swelling. I love that with each period there is an opportunity to gain something new, a marking of time in my own body. I'm coordinated with a full moon, and literally my period comes the day of the full moon. That way you see it as a whole cycle, month by month, and it really gets you to know yourself and your menstrual cycle. So I recommend doing this kind of practices. So another amazing thing is to talk about the period, no? To talk about it and to say it loud and to express. No, I'm I'm with my period. I speak to my daughter, age 11, about my period trying to encourage an open conversation. I feel it all ties in with acceptance of my body and being in tune with my body. I have my period, I can look at my own body and realize that I am able to make a human being and the period just tell me, not this time, but maybe next month. <laughs> yeah. I really like having my period. My journey with my menstruation. I and the period, which is something I know. 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 I know